I'm Hideki Maeda. Uh, I'm Japanese. But I was based in UK a long time, like 20 years ish. Now I'm executive chef of Singapore for season hotel. So I normally start like 10 30, 11 ish in the morning. And we need to check a lot of stages, delivery, chefs, events, everything, meeting. So we just need to tidy up the schedule first and then I attack like one by one. So I'm start cooking like age of 18. So first few years I was a bit confused, like a uh, lot of comics job, uh, washing, blah blah blah. But after that, when we once when we start cooking, cooking, yeah, I discover like more fun for that. And after I moved to the England, UK, and then joined to the kitchen team, I get more double passion for that. I never seen the cooking technique ingredients and then I saw the lots of different background chef that makes me unique. Well the chef Hideki is working no more than 20 years. He knows London's, Africa's, you know now it's Singapore's. He understands the like, novel's philosophy, even the quality of the food. Chef Hideki is a very uh, honor honorable and a very humble chef. And he's uh, really amazing to work with. And I hope to learn more from him under his guidance. So, rice is ready. So, we are using the special gas cooker. Gas is the best. So, basically, break it down the sushi rice, I mean, cooked rice, to make it flat in now. And he's going to mix with the sushi vinegar. So you can see. He always using the paddle to break it down the sauces. So like every single piece of the sushi rice, they get like vinegar to cover it. It is hot, hot sushi rice. After mix with the vinegar, temperature start getting calm. But we are using sushi rice warmer. So we don't like the cold, cold rice, but not hot rice. So cool it down, it's not really cool it down, just dip as a room temperature and then we put it into the box, special box to hold in like our special temperature. That's for the lunch, we do another shot for the dinner service. Cool. Nice one. Best sushi is makes have to be by best fresh fish. And also we have to make sushi rice. So now we have fish and the sushi rice. So after this, have to be slice right size, about 14 or 15 grams. And sushi rice, maybe 12 grams. The between the fish and the rice, Put the wasabi, fresh wasabi is the best because fresh wasabi kills the, uh, the fish bacteria. Sushi rice is the best way, kind of like a room temperature, body temperatures is the best way. Not too hot, not too cold. Make the sushi, put the soy sauce, best way, eat immediately. Enjoy the best. I need to order some fish for next week. Okay. Chef's table on Thursday, so I try yeah. to get everybody on Tuesday. Yeah. What's the deadline? Deadline is Friday. Friday, no? Scallop miso chip one piece and then tuna tacos, salmon tacos, salsa, fire. Fire. So now uh, slowly lunch star service starting and as you can see, still some people doing the miso plus at the back and a few people get involved for the service. 
together with like setting up and Mission Plus, uh, we just need to get ready for the whole day anyway. Nobu became a brand over the last 30 years. Um, it's became well known across the globe. So we have mostly people come from everywhere. Just like a regular operations, you have a guest comes in um, with the reservations mostly. And very seldom we do have a walk-in guest comes in. Um, of course, when we bring them in with a loud irashamase, which means more welcome in the Japanese uh, language, so welcome home. So we bring it, them to the table, our service will bring the menu, greet them, just recommend some sake and beautiful wine selection which we do have. Here in Singapore, new restaurant, different setup. Size of the restaurant is like similar, but more unique setup. Main dining is make it smaller and then full private dining we have. Plus two teppan room. I never seen the noble restaurant set up like this before. Well, Singapore team is uh, pretty uh, big, I would say. From front of the house, we have uh, 22 people. Um, kitchen side, we are in back of the house, and all together, we have almost uh, 55 people working with us. Four. I want for 44. I mean, almost like one o'clock, second team coming from. Yep, to join us and carry on the mission for us taking over some of the service and then we carry on for the whole day process. So first I'm, I'm running at the grill station and then running daily operation, preparing meats, cuts and then kushiyakis and then our signature black corn as well. Working in the grill, we are, we are more concerned about the, the temperature as well as the timing. And sorting station is more about speed and organization and when the operation get really busy, you really need to be very focused as well as to stay organized so that you can send out the dishes in time. So Hideki is in Singapore now, so he must understand more inside the Singapore. What the local people likes and what's the local ingredients, what's the local product, have to be much, much more research, understand more Singapore. Noble restaurant in the world, we have like kind of like standard menu we have to make it standard as it is. Portion size, recipe, everything we need to follow, and then we just adjust, adjust location by location. Kind of like local ingredients, and also the flavor. Some country like more spicy food, some country like more classic Japanese style. So we adjust little by little. Second course for this uh, lunch on Shrimp tempura creamy spicy sauce and our signature black coffee sauce. So now like kind of like end of the lunch service, uh, we are closing the little section. For the service station we close. Uh, Petri still open, few table for the dessert, uh, the sushi bar still going. But like uh, we are doing second team for the food mission plus and we carry on, get ready for the dinner service. So bookings, it's only 88 but it's a Thursday night so please be expected for surprises, okay? The reservations right now, the 7 p.m. we have a 20 bags coming in. So it means obviously those 20 bags we cannot turn back right away. So we will be having a table crunch around 8.30 people, 8.30 p.m. But the number of people we have on the floor today Good amount of service, we should be able to pull this off without any issues. So whoever gets a table at 6, 6, 15, 6, 30, let's try to push the table slightly bit more faster than what you usually do. Because 6, 30 we have 16 tables coming, 16 packs coming in, but 8, 30 we have 18 packs coming in. So the table flow for the middle, I expect to be today to be more crunched than usual. Let's make sure uh, Ricky don't run around, okay? Let's do a good team and uh, let's check our sections. Julia. Three, two, one.
So this is a dinner service. Uh, we just started like hour ago, and uh, now everybody in action. Such uh, also it for dishes and also the whole kitchen. As you can see, start getting busy right now. Go around 80, 90 bucks. Uh, Saturday night, it's okay. It's okay. It's not that crazy. No private function. Something pre-order, separate function. We do focus on like regular restaurant service. That's it. Cool. So this is the backyard of the kitchen. So basically service is not that happen yet. I mean dessert later. So they are still doing the miso plus for now. Endless. We prep for tonight, prep for tomorrow. We carry on as it is. So those things when they get order, going to the front to the, carry on the service. Maybe like depends on the order. Small order, go only one person in the front. And then still carry on the miso plus thing. So this is the dinner service inside the kitchen. So right now we got six people working for the hotline, grill, station. That's a working process for the cooking, cooking. So this is a typical night for the Thursday uh, during the dinner service. Lots of restaurant owner or lots of big name chef everywhere in the world. But Nobusa is like, uh, chef background and he's still chef that's what we feel so he understand what we are doing and we respect each other uh, he understood what chef wanted all the time okay the first one of restaurants 1994 opened in new york now we have less than the five continent so still they keep growing and um, i like to introduce to noble restaurants more to the world um, noble restaurants always looking for which way more better. So never stop about this. So that's all noble restaurant dinner service as it is. Uh, that's a typical Thursday night today, uh, 1890 Gogos, which is fine. Uh, no special function, no complicated one. Easy, simple, straightforward service. It was good. Thank you. Then from 10, once when we get calm down for the restaurant service, we start packing, cleaning down, mission plus for the next day, check the delivery and the order for the next day. So, no restaurant always like challenging. So, day by day, week by week, it's like always different. I mean, most of the restaurant does uh, different things, but this restaurant got like bigger. When I was young, yeah. I was a bit funny feeling, uh, miss everything like normal social life. I choose myself what I want. Almost my whole life is working, but that's okay. Gain something day by day, even like one millimeter or whatever, even small things, not only for the food itself, but every single day we need to gain something.